All right, Cole's about to hit one of his famous backflips. We ain't hit one in a couple weeks. Super pumped, to be honest. I know some of you guys thought this shit was pretty entertaining, so. Gotta shape it up. I know, my leg's tight. Man. What's happening, YouTube? Okay, so today should be uh, mock meat day, so I'm going to, depending on how the sets go, I'm going to say it is, but it all depends a little bit. Friday of this week is going to be our new PR, so today I'm going to touch 340. I'm not feeling quite 100%, but that should be fine. If not feeling 100%, if I still hit my old PR pretty comfortably, I will have a really good gauge of what I'm going for on Friday. Cole should be doing the same thing today. He's out here with us, of course. Uh, I have the schedule uploaded now. Well, not uploaded, but I have it wrote on the board. Uh, Monday is going to be legs. Tuesday is going to be bench. Wednesday is arm wrestling training. Uh, Thursday's legs. Friday's bench. Saturday is arm wrestling training. And then Saturday is bench. And that's going to be the consistent way to do it pretty much from here on out. If anything kind of hiccups in between, you know, and it could throw off a little bit, but that's going to be the schedule. Now, I mentioned in my tour video that the days that I work out are going to be the same, but the days that everything is uploaded, maybe the next day, it just depends on what time we can get everything done. But hopefully everything goes well today, and we're going to be attempting 340 for me today and 235 for Cole today. If everything goes good, like I'm hoping it's going to, then we'll... We'll be seeing how maxes go. I'm hoping that we're going to be pushing some decent numbers on Friday. Uh, also, depending on how this lift goes, I may go for PR in sleeves, but if I'm gassed, I may not. It just depends on how that goes or the slingshot, I mean. Uh, but we'll see. You know, we're going to play it by ear a little bit. But that should be the new schedule, and everything should be pretty consistent. I'll pretty much be training every day, but it shouldn't be too bad. Uh, my legs goals are like my deadlift goals. It's pretty much what it's going to be based around. Aren't very high. I don't have a whole lot of weight I'm trying to pull with it. And I'm going to take that slow. I just want to make sure I get hip, quad, and upper back and lower back development. Uh, I will be doing some back rows when I get a machine in here to do them consistently because I don't want to get too strong with my pushes and then my back uh, becomes a bit of an issue. Uh, Cole trains his back and he does, you know, a lot of other accessory work. So he's not really going to have that problem. But me personally, I don't want that to end up being an issue somewhere where I plateau real bad. So that'll be getting adjusted hopefully pretty soon. Uh, other than that, that should be everything we got going on. And let's get these lifts on, guys. Super pumped. All right, guys, going for a nice warm up. Starting off with the bar, of course. This is off the tripod. So hopefully it looks pretty good. Does it look pretty good so far, Cole? Yeah. Nice. Just the bar, 45 pounds. Let me take this clip off before I look retarded. <laughs> you want me to start that over? No. Warm up set number one. Well, I guess it's number two, 135, going for probably eight, nine, ten, something like that. Make that 12. Warm up set 135. Looking good. Nice. All right, guys, warm up set number two. We got 185. All right, guys, we got Cole's second warm up set, 185. Looks pretty good, solid. Nice. All right, guys, set three, 225.
All right, guys, 205. Cole's on him. Remember what warm up said, I think third. Three. Yeah, third. Oh, that looks really good. That looked easy. Yeah, that looked really good. Hell yeah. Good I'll take set. It. Uh, warm up set four. Got the sling on. Going to do 275 for probably three. If it feels really, really good, maybe four, but probably going to go for three. And it felt really good. All right, guys. Uh, one of our last warm-up sets. Cole's got 225. He's got the slingshot on. I believe we're going for two. That whole set looked really good. All right, guys, I think this is like set four, or excuse me, warm-up set five. This should be one of the last warm-up sets that I do. Uh, well, I may have one more, but anyway, three or five on the bar in the slingshot. Gonna go for two.
All right, guys, you see that shit? You see that shit? Watch the Fuck for YouTube. that. I'm so pumped right now, dude. I don't even care. We got a new PR, baby. Let me make sure I don't look like an idiot writing this. No, I'm so happy. All right, guys, if you enjoyed the comment, like, subscribe. You know the drill. I am so freaking happy with the way everything worked out today. Also, for the supplement review this time, we have Woke AF, uh, Black. Now, I'm not like plates for dates. I can't do uh, all the individual little listings and tell you what they all affect on your body. I'm just going to tell you as a meathead uh, what I feel off of it. To be honest, it's good. It is really good. If you are super stem junkie, take a scoop and a half or a scoop and a quarter. That's what I'm going to have to start doing. One scoop wasn't quite enough for the itchy, tingly feeling or the butthole itches. <laughs> but, but I'm going to be honest, it's really good stuff. It's a little pricey, but it is really good stuff. And the flavor is decent. Um, honestly, I mean, you feel about the same way, don't you? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, it's really good stuff. I would recommend it. It's not my first time taking it, but it has... He had more experience it. with it. When he went to the shop the other day, he actually suggested we get it to do as the first review on the channel. So, yeah, I'm really happy with it. Uh, Y'all stay blessed, guys. Fitness family. Y'all know what to do. Smash that like button. Share the video around. Smash that subscribe button. You know I love you.